International Augmented Reality Showcase is underway in Santa Clara, and one of the big draws this year, personalized holograms. And KPIX 5's Mary Lee shows us how 3D, the images, could soon become part of our daily lives. Welcome to the future. The Augmented World Expo in Santa Clara features 250 companies with the most groundbreaking augmented and virtual reality technology from around the world. Because there's actually water below me, I really don't want to go out there. It's just seeing all these little movements and these increments in the technology put together just make these fabulous experiences. This is a capture space. So. Um, now you see on the screen now we're three-dimensional holograms or avatars. Holocap creates 3D holograms and was just launched on the market two weeks ago. So Holocap is a system for getting real people in real time into any virtual environment. So either it's, you know, it's a virtual moon, it's a virtual bar, a spaceship or a classroom, we can get you into that space. You can make your own hologram that can live forever. It takes about 30 images per second to create your virtual self to take you wherever you want to go. We're talking any type of simulation. It can be used in Hollywood education to medicine. Soon, virtual and augmented reality will be used on the job. A smart screen weighs about a pound and a half. It's fully rugged. You can drop it, throw it in water. You can do all sorts of stuff. Clips onto any pair of glasses. So the whole thing is if you're in a factory and you've got a cable, you're concerned, you can actually pull the cable and the whole thing pops right off. Organizers say augmented reality AR or virtual reality VR will soon be a part of our everyday lives. Uh, I think the main thing that we're seeing this year is that XR, so AR and VR, are really set for major growth. And there are many indications here at the show and across the industry that are pointing to, uh, towards that. In Santa Clara, Mary Lee, KPIX 5.